This is Jimmy D with your Scrutinizer Minute. One of the important security features of Scrutinizer is Flow Analytics. Now, the first question you're going to ask yourself is, what is Flow Analytics? Flow Analytics is the intelligence behind Scrutinizer that detects for suspicious or malicious activity on your network. Best of all, once it finds this, it's going to alert you on it and give you all the reports that you need to find out who and what is causing this. Uh, it's pretty easy to set up. All you have to do is turn it on. Let's check it out. Now that you've installed Scrutinizer, it's time to configure and start your Flow Analytics algorithms. To do that, click on Admin, Settings, Flow Analytics Configuration. Here you'll see all of the Flow Analytics algorithms that are associated with your install. Now we need to associate the flow devices with each of these algorithms. To get a better understanding of what flow devices to associate, click on the Help, and then go to Flow Analytics, and then go to Algorithm Activation Strategy. This will let you know which devices we're looking for when these algorithms are implemented. The next step is to configure an algorithm. So what you do is you find the algorithm that you're looking for, click on it, and up will come the configuration screen. Over here on the right-hand side, you'll see the excluded devices, the devices that we currently are not scanning data from. And over here, of course, is the included devices. Just drag them over and then click Save. Once you've done that, click Edit Policy. Here you're going to be able to edit the notification profile that's associated with it, basically the way you're going to be notified when this algorithm has detected this pattern. Click Close. Click Save. And now Scrutinizer is scanning for those traffic patterns. Now, once it's found one of those traffic patterns, it's going to alert you. It's going to send you a page, an email, whatever you have in that notification profile. Plus, it's going to post on the Alarms tab. Once you get to the Alarms tab, you'll see all of the alerts associated. Now, there's two buckets under the Alarms tab. One is the indicators of compromise and the security events. Indicators of compromise show the individual alerts that have been happening. Once they've found three or more alerts per host, it's going to actually post it to the security bucket. At that point, you really want to take a look at what that event is. There you go. A quick introduction on how to use Scrutinizer. Now, there's a lot more that it can do for your network, so make sure you check out the next in this series or any of the blogs on NetflowNights.com. Well, that's it for today. This is Jimmy D with your Scrutinizer Minute.